So here I am out here at 2803 West 25th in Pine Bluff. I've got this house on the market here, three in it, three bedroom, one and a half bath. We're going to um, go take a look around the outside of the house right now. Um, it is all brick exterior, and you'll be able to see that here in just a minute. You can tell it's all brick, one car carport. And we're coming back here now to the uh, storage building. So um, I wanted to do this live, but YouTube says now I have to have a thousand subscribers to do live from a mobile device anyway. Right back there is your storage building. Pretty good size. We're gonna come around here to the backyard. The backyard is rather small. Still a good enough size to let your kids run around and play, let your dog out. It is fully fenced with a chain link fence. So, um, let's go on into the house now. Like I said, it's three bedroom, one and a half bath. It's sitting on the market right now for 60,000. Um, it comes in just a little over 2,000 square feet. So, uh, you know, that it's a pretty big house for that price. Um, coming in the front door now. You walk in, I'm gonna save that part for last. That's my favorite part of the house. Come right into the living room here. Right. And let's go in the hallway here and check out the bedrooms. Um, to the right is the first bedroom. You can see it there. Okay, we'll come on down the hallway here. And this bedroom is used as a kid's playroom. Um, you know, I guess technically, yeah, it does have a closet in it, doesn't it? I forgot this one had a closet in it. Okay, so there you go. There's the second bedroom. It's rather small, but, um, you know, it worked for a kid, right? Um, this is just a closet. And a linen closet. By the way, tips to sellers. When you get ready to sell your house, just understand that people are going to open closet doors and they want to see what the inside's like. Okay, here's the master bedroom. And we'll come over here to the half bath. We'll half bathroom off the master. Pretty decent size for a half bath. And believe it or not, that pink square tile that's in there and it's in this other bathroom we're going to see, that, that's making a comeback, okay? So don't don't scoff at it. That's really making a comeback. Um, a lot of people like that older look. Okay, here's the full bath. That door also leads into the kitchen. We're going to come around and check it out from this side here. So here's the laundry area. It's right off of the carport. Um, you will need a stackable washer and dryer for that area, but that's not a big deal. Um, right here over my shoulder, we have the kitchen. It's pretty good size, pretty good size kitchen. I mean, you know, you got lots of cabinet space over there, stainless steel vent hood. Um, you could definitely put a stainless steel stove in here if you wanted to match that up. Um, she has, to, she has a refrigerator and a freezer in here, so it's pretty good size. Pretty good size kitchen. There's a little dining area right there. And now for my favorite part of the house. Whoa! Look at this family room. Look how big this thing is. This thing just goes on forever. And that is a wood-burning fireplace back there. So, um, if you're an investor, if you're looking to purchase a home in the Pine Bluff area or know somebody that's looking to purchase a home in the Pine Bluff area, tell them to give me a call. Um, we'd love to help them out. We'd love to show them this house. All right, guys, take it easy.